Hello everyone, I'm L.C. Claus, and today we are going to be making a granola. So I originally got this granola recipe from Joan Jackson, who is a raw food wizard. You should really check out her website. So it's Joan Jackson at Raw Living. So we are going to start out today. I have about two cups of nuts. We have here walnuts and almonds. And to the bowl, we're going to add one cup of pumpkin seeds. Everything we're using today is raw. And so the nuts, I soak them overnight so they're sprouted and soaked. So there's no bite. We wash them and then we dehydrated them. And the same with, so all my nuts and seeds are soaked and sprouted. Okay, so we're going to add one cup of pumpkin seeds. Then we have one cup. Of sunflower seeds, add it. One cup of steel oats that are also soaked. Um, oats and grains also have phytic acid on them, so by soaking them, you can get rid of your phytic acid. So this has been soaked. One cup of steel oats, and then one cup of um, dried cranberries. And you can get them in the bulk section of any of the stores. You can get them without sugar. You can also get them with applesauce. The, um, the applesauce ones aren't quite as, as red. Oh, excuse me, apple juice. So they are, they are sweetened with apple juice. So cranberries go in. And also there are about six dates that are chopped up that are added into this. And so this is the, the bowl. We're going to mix this all together. Now, when is that Santa when I need him? I, I think I hear him. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. I know when you yeah. can hide. I know when you can hide. Oh, Nicholas. You're here in the nick of time. In the nick of time. Yes, I need some help. So what I'm going to do, I've added all my ingredients together here for the granola. Oh, we're making granola. Yes. Yes. So do you have clean hands? All right, well, hands are clean, and they are going to be put into gloves. Okay, so here are gloves. I'm going to have you put on the gloves, and then I'm just going to have you work this through your fingers. So Santa is going to squeeze all of this through his fingers. It helps mm. the dates kind of mush around, sweetens it all. And while he is doing that, we'll put him over here doing that, I am going to make the sauce that will go on top of the granola. So in the sauce, we have two apples that are chopped up, different sizes. We're going to put them in here. Just toss them in the blender. I'm so glad you're here to help Santa. Such a helpful Santa. Going to add a teaspoon of salt, some seasoning, some cozy spice, which is basically cinnamon, nutmeg, some ginger, and I think mace, nice and Christmassy. Some vanilla. Well, you can actually put it to taste, but there's one half teaspoon to, to um, one tablespoon, whatever works for you. And oh. I think I have about one tablespoon in there of vanilla. And then I'm going to put one drop of um, orange essential oil. So if you were using an extract, you could use up to a teaspoon. Essential oil you want to use just one drop. So this, this is actually a B. Young essential oil. It's pure. So it, it, it's really powerful. So I just need one drop. Whoop. Whoop, there was two. Whoop. I think That's going to be really orangey. Orange. I love orange. How about you, Santa? Oh, I love it, too. Okay. This will be great for me and the elves to keep our energy up Ooh. while we're delivering presents. Oh, I know. You just grab. You can have granola. You can use it as for breakfast in the morning with some yeah. hemp milk and some extra fruit onto that. Or, you know what, Santa? What? I think we should add some blend fresh products into our applesauce, holding this together. It would be yes. absolutely delicious. I think since we are flavoring it orange, we should go with the orange. I mean, go let's, with the orange. Okay. Let's, let's take a look at this orange. Let's smell the orange. These taste delicious on it, just by themselves. Orange it is. 
Yeah, you can mm. have so inside each of the colors. So we have four colors here. We have red, green, purple, and orange. So inside each one of these, there's 12 different fruits and vegetables. And within that particular color family. So this is the orange family, and inside this we have carrots, carrot juice, um, sweet potato, pumpkin. A butternut squash, banana, mango, pineapple, peach, yellow bell peppers, lemon juice, orange juice, and it goes on. There's, so there's 12 extra fruit and vegetables, and this would be just perfect to add into our applesauce, which is our binder for our granola. And like I said, you can have granola for snacks, you can have it for breakfast. I actually make granola bars, and so when I dehydrate it, I'll show you exactly how I do that, but um, that way I can just grab a bar and one. You don't have to worry about loose granola. Very good, Elsie. And then if you want to use it for breakfast, then you just break up your bar into your dish, right? Right, Santa? That's right. Okay, so we have our seasoning. It's a very nice finger food. And our apples. I like it better than cookies. It actually is a healthy cookie. There we go. It's working. Oh, oh, amazing. Oh, so amazing. <laughs> Using the applesauce mode, which is the ice cream button. Okay, so here we go. Open this up. Take a look. Oh, look. oh it looks good. Oh, it does. Just throw it in here so I can mix smell, it up. Oh, Santa, smell it. Ooh. Oh, I do smell it. I can smell it from here. That's not delicious. That's so okay. delicious. Get that in here. So Santa's done a very good job of mixing up all of our nuts and yeah. seeds. Mixed up. And the, the oats. And so I just pour this on top. Mm-hmm. And Santa? I'm going to let you go ahead and mix this up, and I'm going to grab the dehydrator sheets. Okay. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. Let me mix it up, and you go grab the dehydrator sheets. We just love our Glen Tech Pro. So since our granola is all raw, we will use the dehydrator to dehydrate. Oh, just a moment, just a moment, just a moment, nameless. So those of you that are not familiar with dehydrator, this is what a dehydrator tray looks like. It has this, sits on top of this. Dehydrator screening and dehydrator paper. Yes, and you can actually use parchment paper. This is a special, um, let's make it. so let's divide it in, we'll divide our, oh, you're doing just fine. And we're going to divide in half. That's that's perfect, Santa. And here is a second sheet. I'm going to put it over here. Okay. And over there. I use it. Anyway, it's real good. Just grab one of these devices from the hardware store, and you just spread it out. And what or I do, use your hands. or use your hands, of course. You can always use your hands. You just spread it out. An even manner on top of the Teplex sheets. That's what they're called, Teplex sheets. Yes, Teplex sheets. And you spread them out. There, you, you use that. And I'll, we have Santa's beard in there. I'll demonstrate with my hands. And you can just make it with your hands. Okay, and then you just get it in kind of a square. As close to a square as you possibly can, or at least get the corners. Or any shape you'd like. You can make this into a snowman. 
Hey, look, it's frosty. And then you just very good. Fold like this. You make your bars ahead of time. Line them up. Yeah. What do you call this, Santa? It's called scoring. That's right. Do the scoring. <laughs> Make the size that you want. And then they're ready. No, oh, Santa, you need help. Here. So this is what it'll look like. We're going to stick it into the dehydrator. Mm, Santa needs help. Here, let me help, Santa. All right. Help me, help me. They're looking good. <sighs> and so I'm going to stick this into the uh, uh, dehydrator. And it'll take about... Mm, Three days? No, 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 no. Maybe four to six hours. Then oh. I just take them. Just in time for dinner. Yes, just in time for dinner. Then I take them and then I will I will turn over the Teflex. I will get another um, screen, put it on this side, flip it over, and then put it back in for another two hours or so, and then they'll be ready to eat. Wonderful. Yes. So well, there you go. There's your holiday mix for granola, granola bars or granola. So Merry Christmas and Happy, and happy Holidays! Holidays. Hope you see you soon. Bye. Bye.